Support for Kalamazoo Lively Arts is provided by the Irving S. Gilmore Foundation. Watch Kalamazoo Lively Arts every Tuesday at 6 p.m. MRC is a nonprofit organization that puts adults with disabilities to work. Artworks is one branch of MRC. There are several different branches, and here we bring our artists in to help them learn how to create art, but we also teach them to sell the artwork so they have that interaction with the community. MRC started an art program because there was an interest in art. A lot of our clients and individuals expressed in interest in art, and art therapy is an excellent way to help them heal and show their emotions. Jeanette, now we have a blank canvas here, and you are um, great at painting trees. So tell me how you would start as far as your background is concerned with the sponge. Well, we do this way. Okay, can I try that? See if I can do it. <laughs> Probably not, because I'm not as good as you are. You're doing it. You're the artist. <laughs> yes. Not, not me. You're the artist. Mm -hmm. Okay? Okay, so now we're making our background. And I need yellow. Yellow? Okay. Yellow. We'll get some yellow, and then we'll put the yellow in the background, too. We do all sorts of arts. Um, we do acrylic on wood boards. We do female clay. We do beading and jewelry. We do felt felting, needle felting. We do crocheting and yarn work. So we um, open our studio up to a wide variety of artwork. We do what they want to do. So if they come in with an idea, we're like, yeah, let's try that. And if it sells well, we continue with it. Okay, where do we start with the tree? You could go like this. Okay. And sometimes, like my teacher says, you could go over some of them. Okay. Like this. Okay. Now I can hardly see that. That's really just the beginning, isn't it? When you get at the tree that looks like your picture, right. where you have to keep going over it and over it and mm -hmm. over it. Yes, okay. we have to do it because it sells more. Okay. What the customers want to buy it, they get the, oh, that's just a nice way to do it. Okay. And you want to do half good, not, not, not do right. it all. Right, right, okay. Jeanette, why do you like being here so much? Why do you like doing this? Because it gives me something to do. Why do you think art is so important? Well, before, I went to my culture. They're talking about MRC. I like it. What would you be doing if you weren't here, Jeanette? I'd be bored. You'd be bored, yeah. I'd go I get nervous stuff. Right. So I want to be here with Janelle and Holly and the new one. Why do you like doing drawing trees? Why do you like it's my favorite because they sell more. They sell more in a cat because trees do some more because they're like a, like a plant. They grow like a plant. Hey, let's keep on with our trees. Our instructors work on a one-to-one -one basis with people. We sit in the middle of our tables and work around our tables. Um, everybody is assigned a workspace, so they have their own workspace. When they come in, we have them do sketches, and then we do thumbnails, and we do research, and we use um, a lot of research offline for what the um, instructors will look at what's trending and what's popular right now so we can create sellable art. We'll take their sketches and their thumbnails and we'll ask them what they want to do with it. Once we figure out what they want to do, whether they want to do clay or painting, we help them um, transfer that onto the medium that they want to use. You did it. Not bad. And you could go this way too. Okay. I can't, you know, I like art because it gives me something to do. You make money to help people out, brushes and paint. Some of that money goes back to the, the staff, buy some paints and brushes and stuff. Have you always liked art? I love art. I'm not gonna quit. I'm gonna stay here. I'm not gonna quit because I love it. I'm out in the community. 
you home? You home? You had to take a look at your roommate, Yaki. You know. Who taught you how to be an artist, Jeanette? Who taught you how to be an artist? Myself. Yourself taught? Yes. Through here? Yes, from MRC. Through being at MRC, you're, you learned to be an artist? Yes. Well, I like it because I'm here with all my friends. And in the lovable teachers I got, especially Janelle. Um, the artwork is important for our artists because they are able to express themselves and they are able to create something and be proud of it. It really helps with their self-esteem. It helps them learn the job skills that they're going to need to get a job in the community in the future. And with their artwork being so reasonably priced, they get that paycheck, so they get that reinforcement that I can do this. And Jan, what makes the Artworks program so special? I think it's really special because it gives adults with disabilities an outlet to do something creative, to paint, to sculpture, to make a, a creative project. Um, they have a purpose every morning where they get up, get out of bed, get on the bus a lot of times, and make their way down to downtown Kalamazoo to work on their art projects every day. And they're there from 10 o'clock in the morning until 4 o'clock in the afternoon. And I understand they have a gallery on the mall. They do have a gallery on the Kalamazoo Mall. And what makes it nice is that people um, stop by, come in, um, look at the paintings on the wall and say, I'd like to, I'd like that one. And then the artists will come and talk about their, their work a little bit. And um, when a piece is sold, the artist actually gets a portion of the sales. So um, they feel like they have a job to do, like they can make money from this, uh, like they have a purpose. And when I was there, when we were working on an art project, it was really fun because they have a whole concept about how they want to put the colors in and what the scene should look like. And um, for me, who's not an artist, uh, it, was really, it was really fun as well. Great, thank you for that story. Watch Kalamazoo Lively Arts every Tuesday at 6 p.m.